Hi everyone, um, I'm back after a very long time. Um, I think the last time I made a video was back in maybe July or August. Um, so I just wanted to give you guys an update on what, what I'm up to and what the future holds for me. I have some good news. But to start off with I left where I left off, um, I think my last video I said I was going to do, um, I, I was thinking of doing like hair videos and stuff. Um, I did open a new channel um, for like hair tutorials and what I do with my hair and stuff. As you can see, it's really grown compared to my um, like videos on my juice uh, detox you saw, like the length. So it's really grown at the moment, but I've actually deleted that channel. I couldn't really keep up with um, doing the videos, so I kind of just do my own stuff. At home and not record it um but if you do want to see anything or know anything or how i maintain my hair or anything just let me know and maybe i'll make a video or i'll leave you some tips or i can also put up my a few of my old videos onto this channel um i'm just going to keep this channel and concentrate on it i don't want as i said i didn't really have time um to maintain both channels um so yeah i've actually wrote down the things i want to say because um, if you have seen my other videos, I never have a lot to say or like I'll go away and I'll think of stuff that I should have said in the video that I've got to. So anyways, um, since I left off in July, I had a birthday in August. It was my 25th birthday. I'm 25. I'm for 50, old age. But anyways, um, that was good. I went to dinner with um, some friends and family and celebrated it with them nice and sweet nothing too fancy um yeah that was since good. um september actually no before i get into that um i also said in um one of my past videos that i was supposed to be going on holiday september um the plan was actually to go to um singapore singapore and south korea i was supposed to be going to singapore for a few days and then south korea for um just over a week but that didn't um turn out the way i had planned um yeah so i didn't go i'm still in london however i did start applying for jobs abroad which i did mention to you guys before i was mostly concentrating in korea but i did um have some interviews for um japan i had an interview for japan i had a few for china and I had one for Korea. My Korea interview, I didn't have it because 10 minutes before my interview, my internet cut out. So I feel like it's a sign. Maybe I'm not supposed to go to Korea. From since last year when I was applying and I didn't get any results. And then again this year, well, I got a result to have an interview. Um, and then just before my interview, my internet cut out. So maybe it's just not meant to be at the moment. Maybe in the future. Not maybe. In the future. <laughs> hopefully uh yeah so yeah i had interviews for china got some good results and i'm going to china <laughs> um i'll say I'm, I'm going to china i'm actually supposed to be going next week to teach there um however I still don't have my visa. I've been working on my visa, getting it done. I went yesterday and um, applied for it, gave them my paperwork and stuff. So I'll find out for definite on Wednesday um, what is happening. So I can't say, oh, I'm definitely going, but I'm going. There's no reason for them to deny my visa. Like, I'm not a criminal. Uh, like yeah i'm not going to run away there because i don't necessarily want to settle in china anyways um so yeah i'm waiting on my visa and hopefully fingers crossed i'll be going to china next year to teach um if they deny my visa i'll just have to apply again because i have a job like i've signed my contract i've started buying stuff as you can see my suitcase there there's one behind it as well you can't really see this clothes excuse my room it's like really messy you can see like um clothes and stuff over there yeah um 
so yeah China next week I should be leaving well if I get my visa on Wednesday I plan to book my ticket on the Wednesday and leave on the Friday so I'm there I'll arrive there Saturday uh, afternoon um, my city is it's called Xinyang um, spell S H E N Y A N G Xinyang it's in the north of China uh, like above Beijing to the, the the right I think it's like yeah to the right um, so yeah that's where I'll be staying my contract is for a year and I'll be teaching English to children well, young children in a language school and yeah that's about it I'm very excited about it a bit nervous and excited um but because of my visa when i haven't bought my ticket it's kind of like if someone asks me oh you're excited i'm like yeah kind of but i haven't been able to enjoy the fact that i'm finally doing something that i want to do because it's still what if i get denied <laughs> like then what what do i do but if that's the case and yeah, I'll just keep pushing forward and try because it's something I really want to do and I've been pursuing for the last like two to three years so I'm not just going to give up now um, I've wasted like not wasted I've put too much time into this to just give up because China won't accept my my visa application or whatever so yeah that's the plan next week um, yeah so I plan to put up videos like while I'm in China and document my life there. However, they don't have YouTube. They don't have YouTube. And most of the time I'm on YouTube like watching um, like shows and stuff. Like mostly Korean shows on like KBS World and stuff like that. Um, but I don't know. There's quite a few people. There's a few people who put up videos while in China, but not a lot because of that block. So there must be some kind of loophole or maybe they're not as strict on it at the moment but I won't find that out until I get there so hopefully you'll see some more videos from me while I'm out there and if not I'll try some other way to um, post videos um, and have some fun uh, what else do I have to say to you guys um, that's it really um yeah that's what i have to say <laughs> um yeah so i'll see you guys soon bye